The Newport girls soccer team headed into yesterday's non-divisional bout with Hinsdale with wins in two of its last three games. So needless to say, Coach John Hamble's squad was eager to keep that momentum rolling in the right direction. And the Tigers had no trouble preying on a young Hinsdale team, benefiting on goals from four different sources on its way to a convincing 6-0 victory. Junior Katrina Stark led Newport with an impressive hat-trick, including this unassisted score on a corner kick midway through the second half that put the home team up 4-0. From there, it was a pair of seniors who found the back of the net with their first ever goals. Katrina Batista started that trend when she sent this one-timer well over the head of the Hinsdale goalkeeper, prompting an emotional celebration with her teammates. Then, some two minutes later, starting goaltender Mariah Chase was moved to the front line and wasted little time before firing this offering into the corner of the net to round out her team's scoring. I spoke with Newport coach John Hamill after the game, who touched on the significance of earning back-to-back -back wins and improving to 500. That's huge. I mean, we've, we've had um, two wins in a row now. We're 3-3 three and three on the season. Um, all six games have been extremely close. We, uh, we, we've had three two to one games. We had a, um, two three to one games and, the, and then this one. So it's, it's definitely a positive experience. The girls are, are, are playing their hearts out and, um, you know, things, things are coming together right now. Um, we're, we, we played a pretty tough schedule and uh, we're, we're thrilled to be three and three right now. It was great to see uh, two, two seniors scored their first goal ever, which was awesome. Um, we had a junior score her first goal and um, we had some freshmen and sophomore who typically haven't got a lot of playing time to to be able to play, which is which is excellent. It's unfortunate we don't have a JV JV team, so this is invaluable to them. So the Trot Tigers will try and win their third straight game Friday when they travel to face Conan. Now taking a look at the YCN scoreboard, the Hartford girls soccer team benefited from a pair of goals from Rachel Seaver on its way to a 4-0 victory over Springfield, while the Stevens and Lebanon field hockey teams also came away with impressive wins. And on the hardwood, Leah Barrows led the Hanover volleyball team past Fall Mountain behind a 17 for 17 effort from behind the service line, while the Stevens and Mascoma and Sunapee volleyball teams came up winless in their respective matchups. That does it for your look at local sports, I'm Mike Pizzone.